Today I want to give you an overview over the technical function of the vehicle. I want to show you the suspension, the steering, the drivetrain and also how to change the adapters on the back. So how to take off and put back on the load bay on the back. So come with me for a little test drive and see what this vehicle can do. So we're just on the way home from our little test drive in the forest and now on the way down we are actually charging the batteries so you can here check the screen at the moment we are charging with 9 kilowatts roughly and as I'm accelerating you can see we charge more and more and more and also I can just step off the accelerator and the vehicle stops immediately. I don't need to use any brakes, so there is no wear on the brakes, there is no overheating. Every bit of energy goes straight back into the battery. So I want to show you the next feature, which is the super low center of gravity. I'm going to drive up this ramp only with one wheel and see how much bank angle I can get on the vehicle. Actually, I'm way too scared to go all the way because I don't know where it tips. But this is one thing we want to find out before we go to Ojos del Salado. And then also, while driving up, you will notice how the back and the front vehicle will start to twist. This is because there is a hinge in the middle here where the whole vehicle can twist, which allows it to adapt to unevenness in the terrain. So let's see what it looks like when we drive up the ramp. So I could probably go a lot further than this because there's no way the vehicle is going to tip, but I'm just too scared. So we will do it once by fixing a rope to the roof to some point so it can't actually tip and then just go as much as we can, but right now I'm just too scared. So we're just trying a quick real-life work situation where you would uh, drop off this loading bay, go do some other job with another uh, attachment on the back and then come back, pick this one up and go home. So just to show quickly how fast you can attach it and remove it and also to show the hydraulic suspension that lifts and then the all-wheel steering. So now that I've taken off the loading bed, it's a great moment to show you how the all-wheel steering works. As you can see right now, only the front wheels are turned, the back wheels are completely straight. So the vehicle has quite a big turning circle. But now I can activate the all-wheel steering and the vehicle is basically able to turn on a dime. So I'll show you on this square how this works. So the next cool thing is it actually can do the crab walk. So you can turn all four wheels to the same direction, which enables the vehicle to drive sideways. That's what I'm gonna show you now.
So this loading bridge is basically held up by this hydraulic clamp. Now I'm gonna open that up so I can lower it down, raise the drivetrain, and then we can drive off with the loading bed.